Hi everyone, and welcome to the latest Mech Spotlight. Taking center stage today is the demon samurai of the Mech Arena, the one and only Tengu. Wow, that mech looks pretty cool. Just wait until you hear what it can do. I'm all ears. Tengu is designed for surprise attacks. It's great for sneaky beacon capturing and ambushing enemy mechs. So it's a scout? Correct, but a durable one. It's pretty solid in one-on-one -on -one fights against other scouts. But you still want to avoid confrontations with heavy mechs at full HP. Try to make your move when they're busy or otherwise vulnerable instead. Okay, so this thing's built for surprising the enemy? Oh yeah, and it's got a neat trick up its sleeve for doing just that. It's called Sky Strike, and it launches you high up into the air. Like Lancer's jump jets? Kind of. The difference is that as soon as Tengu activates Sky Strike, stealth systems engage that prevent the enemy team from targeting you. Okay, like jump jets with a twist. Right, and there's more. When Tengu lands, he slams into the ground, dealing significant damage to all the mechs in the immediate area and slows them all down. You're kidding me! So Tengu can surprise a whole team behind cover and damage all of them in one slam? And slow them down for the rest of your team to clean up. That's awesome. Okay, so talk to me about weapons. Well, with a max capacity of 16, it can't really bring the big guns. Sure. Although, I guess you're going to be using your Sky Strike in close proximity to the enemy, right? Exactly. And you have some good close range options, like shotguns and arc turrets. They're a perfect match for Tengu's surprise attack style. So, surprise the enemy from behind, slow your targets, hit them with some burst damage, and get out of dodge. You got it. Okay. And how about javelin racks? Tengu can jump up to high ground, like Lancer. So, would jabs work for Tengu too? I wouldn't recommend it. Tengu has to get close, and Javelin Rack requires some distance. Try combining Sky Strike with Burst Damage Weapons instead. It just works better. Roger that. So, what's the strategy? Well, picture the scene. You've just activated your Sky Strike and blown all your shotgun ammo. You're surrounded by the enemy, and both your weapons and your ability are on cooldown. Sounds awkward. Exactly. So, you want to look before you leap and pick an escape route before you go for the ambush. Tengu is a scout mech, remember? Let your teammates with the big guns seal the deal. Or, I guess, survive long enough to use Sky Strike to escape. Right. And bear in mind that Guardian, Zephyr, and Redox, even when slowed down, can still use their abilities. So you'd be smart to time your Sky Strike for after they've used them. Noted. Hey, do you think it'd be possible to win a match with Tengu using no weapons at all? If you were careful about picking your engagements, I don't see why not. Sounds like a challenge. However, that'll have to wait for another time, because that is it for our Tengu Spotlight. Hit like and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos like this one. We'll see you next time.